us, City Block in particular, like we've moved away from using token at all. So the term. The term, yeah. yeah. So we look at ourselves as a digital asset. That's how we sell ourselves to investors. Uh, the large majority of our investors are very traditional investors that, you know, there'll be people that say, like, I don't believe in cryptocurrency, <laughs> but they want exposure to the blockchain space. Got right. It. So we don't use security. So, I mean, I th and I think as an industry, like, we have to kill the term. <laughs> and I, you know, I, I, that's why, like, you know, sec Securitize is talking about digital security offering. You just don't want to be married to that forever because if you're talking about, you know, quadrillion dollars of assets, right, that are out there, they're traditional assets that will eventually become digital securities. Um, I, I'm just trying to push away from that terminology. So you said you were talking to traditional investors that want to want exposure to the blockchain space. Now you guys offer that because your fund is all blockchain, but like real estate, that's not the blockchain space. But they might. It, does that still apply? I mean, is well, it that yeah, I mean, I, I would add, like, uh, for me, the, whatever we're doing needs to be fundamentally better than what exists today, right? So real estate is an example where it's a confusing market. There's no transparency. It's very opaque. You don't know what's yeah. going on. It's hard to keep track of. And so, you know, tokenization and digital securities offer a different and better experience. And I think if the things we're creating aren't better experiences for investors, we're doing the wrong thing.